In this video, I am going to explain how to simulate a DC motor and we can write a program to run turn on motor when a push button is pressed. That is experiment number 3 we are going to do now. So, to, I am going to show the simulation using Tinkercad. So, refer previous video how to create a Tinkercad account and do the circuits. This is the code. So let me explain this after that I will do the simulation. So this uh, when the button is pressed the DC motor is actually running here and if I release it will stop. So this is the code int button state is equal to 0. We are configuring pin number 2 as input because we are using push button. Push button is an input device where have to give I, uh, that uh, push button state to the input from the pin number 2 we are reading the status of push button ok and uh, pin number 10 is configured as output so whenever we send logic i to logic this one this is uh, here we can write we can send logic i so this if it is connected to the coil uh, current will pass through that and uh, magnetic field will be generated according to that uh, this is a relay this is a relay this is a DC motor and uh, this DC motor will run by this or you can connect external power supply also you can connect instead of this battery. So here button is input device. Okay. So relay is here actually we can use it as an output and uh, you can send logic I here. So this coil will get energized and get uh, magnetic field will be generated and the uh, uh, switching action will take place whenever this circuit is complete this DC motor and battery circuit is complete then the DC motor is going to run so whenever we we'll send logic high here magnetic will be generated and switching action will take place normally it will be uh, now it is normally open when I press this here actually current will pass through and uh, switching action will take place and circuit will complete and motor is going to run so we require on Arduino you know on push button resistor DC motor and this how to do this you can see here you have to create create new button new design okay create select circuits so place on Arduino you can uh, use more scroll to adjust the size then we want one push button on DC motor on uh, relay with button push button on resistor On resistor, then on battery. Okay, that's all. So now we'll start the connection. So this is a push button. You can connect one end of push button to resistor so that it can connect to ground. Another one, it connect to 5 volts. Right now, this thing should be connected. Yes.
connect this end to 5 and here terminal 8 should be connected to 10 so connected by 6 this so will make the plan now Can change the color of any wire to your own choice. Okay, this connection is over now. So to write a code here, by default blocks will be there. So select text and here your by default program it is a blinking of led program will be there it this you have to replace with uh, this word code okay pin 2 is configured as input pin 10 is configured as output we are reading a uh, button state using uh, we are by calling digital read pin number 2 if button is equal to i okay if button is equal to i we have to write digitally that pin number uh, 10 we have to write i else digital write same digital pin number 10 as low so once you press the button okay by default it is low if i press the value of uh, pin number 2 is now at logic 0 if i press this button this 2 is connected to that vcc 5 volts so once you press this this is actually connected to VCC. By default, it is now open. So it will take logic 0. If I press this, it will take logic high. So now let me simulate this. Start simulation. So you can observe motor is running. If I click this, I am clicking this. If I uh, stop clicking on this, it will stop. So this program will actually interface motor using relay. We use the relay also, speedity relay we used. Use Arduino board and we wrote a program to turn on the motor when push button is pressed okay so code you can see here components you can, you can also use instead of this you can also use power supply 5 volts power supply also you can use thank you